Welcome back everybody to another All Things Nerd video. As always, my name is Nathan. Welcome back to exploring the world of Azeroth in World of Warcraft. Today's adventure leads us to the old Brad Foothills down in the Caverns of Time. We are going to be breaking out of bounds and I'm going to be showing you around the surrounding areas. Now, we are at the base of the dungeon. We haven't gone into the portal, so let's walk in and let's go take a look. Now, I'm excited to do this breakout today because, whoo, man, my dude changed into a human. I forgot that uh, that happens. <laughs> I'm assuming because of lore, lore wise, right? Maybe all you lore junkies can correct me on what's going on here and why we're a human and not a night elf. But let's make our way into the dungeon. Now, I am going to be using Game Uncrafters trick on getting out of the dungeon so if you have never seen a game on crafters channel i definitely recommend him he's uh i haven't talked to him personally i've actually never m met him before but i have watched a lot of his videos and he's given me some inspiration for some of my videos and i have used some of his other tricks so i definitely do recommend watching him i'll put his uh channel in the uh, comment section below and uh yeah go check him out so we're actually going to be using his technique. Now, as we make our way through the dungeon here, we're going to be getting to the bottom down here with all the water. Now, what's really cool is I love this dungeon. You can actually see uh, Kel Thusad over here before he got corrupted by the Lich King. And you can actually see a lot of uh, old uh, human NPC models out here as well. Just kind of fun. So, anyways, all right, so what we're going to do is we're going to make our way out here into the water. Now, when we do that, um, we're actually going to hit a wall. And one thing I recommend that he actually recommended as well was a uh, inky black potion. And the reason you want this on you is it actually gets rid of the fog of war. A lot of you might be familiar of what the fog of war is. It is a uh, black fog that kind of covers your area that you cannot see outside the map like this right here. But luckily, if we drink a inky black potion, that all goes away. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna make our way out this way until we hit the wall. There we go, we've hit the wall. And we're gonna swim out in this direction. Now, what we're gonna wanna do is we're going to want to jump out. Now there is one spot and it's right down here below the water. And like I said, we're gonna be using game on crafters method so we're going to swim down here in the water and we're going to hit another wall now it's going to be right around this area so i need to change my talents because i want to get or you know what i think we just metamorphosis it's going to be around here somewhere there's something around here there it is okay we got it we got it we're out of bounds now we are officially out of bounds, so let's go take a look around. Now we gotta keep this inky black potion on, unfortunately, because if we don't, the fog of war is gonna come back, and uh, we don't wanna do that, so. We wanna go explore this dungeon freely. Now this is gonna be kind of a nighttime type video, so I hope you guys are ready to kind of relax with some cool Hillsbrad, old Hillsbrad foothill ambience out here. And uh, let's go take a look around. Now, as you can see, we are out of the dungeon. Normally, you're not supposed to be out this far. So let's go check out some of the uh, area out here and see what things look like in times past. Now, one thing I do love about the Inky Black Potion is it does give you this cool night starry, I don't know, feel to it. It's very homey. We don't want to walk far too right because we don't want to walk into bounds. But I think we're okay out this way. So let's go explore the town out here. And I'm going to hide my HUD because I don't want you guys to get distracted with that. I want you to be able to see the video. Let's go into one of these forges. Now what's interesting, the music does change when you come in here. So all the props and everything is active, even the music. Let's go check out one of these cool farms. Actually, let's go check out Town Hall first.
You can see there's nothing inside these rooms. They are modeled, but nothing too much. No chairs, no benches, no tables. And I think we got an apple farm over here across the way. And we're going to go check out this little cabin over here, which the fire looks very cozy. Ah, you could just sit there for hours. <laughs> but we got to keep moving because we want to check out the video. And I'm not going to go into the barn. I know the barn is just a regular barn. It has everything inside of it. Not too much to explore, but I will take you over to this house. Full house, still modeled. You can walk in these. Not too much going on here. I never understood the spooky music they put in houses, especially when they're empty. I don't get it. I don't get Blizzard's decision in that, but not my game, not my call. All right, let's go head out this way and see if uh, how much of uh, Trisfall Glades we can see. Ah, we're getting hit with the wall. Now the real question is, can we break out of bounds? We are a demon hunter. So I don't know how to get out of here. But we're going to see if we can figure out a way by using metamorphosis, maybe. There we go. Boom, easy peasy. First try, let's go. And we hit another wall. <laughs> uh, all right, forget it. We're going to use, uh, we're going to go back to... Uh, we're going to go back to Vengeance here. I don't know why we're on Havoc anyways. We don't need Havoc right now for the Fell Rush. And we're going to see if we can keep making our way out. Now, unfortunately, we might keep hitting walls, which kind of sucks. Oh, this wasn't even a way out anyways. Look at that. I was all bragging for nothing. All right. Ah. Uh... So I feel like we're getting out, but we're not really getting out. So I don't know what's going on with the game. So maybe we can make our way... Alright, let's see if we can go around. We're just gonna have to go the long way around. Or maybe we can go back this way. Let's go try out this way first. This might be a, a harder dungeon to break out of. Which we already have. But we're getting stopped with boundary walls, which is interesting to me that they put up even more walls to stop you for doing things. But it's usually what Blizzard does. No fun policy. All right, we can get up here. So this is interesting. So maybe out this way. Just got to go the long way around. Now we're getting in with another wall. Son of a gun. Well, I'm going to be honest with you guys. I've never actually done this dungeon out of bounds yet. So we're just going to have to learn together if we can get out of this or not. So far, nothing is really working for me. And I thought that this would be a lot easier. But they really do not want you back there. So let's go see if we can keep heading up this way. And see if another way works. See if we can make our way all the way around. But, you know, guys, this is our first nighttime video, so this is actually pretty cool. I am enjoying this. Hope you guys are too. Alright, so here goes the pathway to Truthful Glades. Let's see if we can get over the gate over here. Which we might be able to jump up here and do some maneuvering. Maybe not. Okay, let's try this way. Okay. I think we might have to even switch back the uh, Havoc form again. So we can scale, but maybe right there. You know what, let's switch back to Havoc. 
and see if we can do Fell Rush. There we go. And let's go get up here and see if this works. Ah, there we go. Got over the wall. And we are officially in Tristful Glades. Now this is cool. Oh, gosh, another wall. Gosh, dang it. Really, game? Really? Man, it does not... Ah, okay. But look at it. We hit a wall and then we had another wall. <laughs> ah, this is horrible. You ever want to come... Oh, maybe a way around... No, we're hitting walls after walls after wall. Maybe this way? I don't know. I don't know where... It, so I'm guessing this is like the stopping ground? Man, this is not an easy dungeon to break out of. I thought we did the easy part. But, I guess I lied. I mean, we are over the wall. So that's cool. But how the heck can we keep going out is the question. So maybe what we need to do is just go back that way and keep going around. So let's go up here. You know what we might need to do is we might need to scale the mountains. So what we might want to do is come up this way, right here. And then see if we can make our way out this way. If we can't, then I'm not sure if we, yeah, that was okay. That was a lot easier than I thought. So I'm hoping what we can do is get up high enough to where we can just skip the boundary wall. There we go. So far doing so well. And if we don't suck. The only thing is this is not high enough, so let's make our way out this way. And let's go ahead out this way. Oh, I thought we just said another wall. I was like, no, you gotta be kidding me. The only thing is, there's not really an easy place to climb. This is one of the more difficult dungeons, that's for sure. But let's go up this way. Alright, here we go. I think we might have found a cool path. We can just keep going up. Should be good. Nice, I like this spot. Oh, that's a cool view. Let's take a screenshot of that. Nice, okay. So we were able to come out this way. What we're gonna have to do is let's wait for our fell rush charge, come up here. And what we might be able to do, swing all the way around this way. Or we're gonna hit a wall. I don't know. Moment of truth, my friends. Alright. We're gonna wait for our second fell rush here. Ah, okay. So far we're doing good, but we're not past the wall yet, so we need to make our way out this way. And see if we can get around the uh, invisible walls out here. Don't know if it's going to let us, but we can definitely try. It's going to be moment of truth. Nope, there's another wall. Son of a gun. Trying to metamorphose out. Nothing so far. Well, these boundary walls must go pretty stinking high. I do want to show you guys what it looks like without the inky black potion. 
so you can see the fog of war of what I'm talking about. We are completely engulfed back here, so we can't see nothing. So that's why we got to have that on, unfortunately. Now, you know what? I don't think there's going to be too much of this video, so I apologize, guys. I thought there's going to be a lot more we could explore. Let's head out back this way. And maybe we can go up to the Alteric Valley. Let's go try that. Ah, uh, there is a mine over here. Interesting. Let's see if the mine, we can go inside of there. That's kind of cool. I like the slow fall action we got going on here. See if the mine is accessible. It looks like it. And it looks like everything's still intact, too. There is no map to it, unfortunately. Ooh, this is spooky. Ah, oh, man, this mine is huge. You know, take candle. That was my Cobo impression. Hope you guys liked it. Got some creepy ambience going on out of here. Now let's go make our way back out the entrance, or the exit, I guess you could say. And let's go find a way out of here. There we go. Let's get out of this spooky cave. There we go. We're back out. Alright, let's go head out this way. And what we're gonna do is we're not gonna go fully back into bounds, because you got the entrance portal, we came down here. We definitely want to make our way back up north. But that did stop us originally, so... We're gonna try a different approach here and tactic here as well. Let's see if we can make our way up this way and scale out. Here's a cave over here. Normally you can't get to, but it is on the map. All right, we're not going to go all the way through there because I think it's just going to be another dead end cave. So let's go out this way. And I'm hoping we're not going back into bounds here. I don't think we are. We're still fairly out of bounds on the map here. Yep, we're hitting a wall. And nothing. Nothing at all. Man, it's just wall after wall after wall after wall out here. Well, guys, I might need to end the video. Because I am stuck and can't get out any farther. Unfortunately. I was hoping that we might be able to make it out, but it's not looking like we're going anywhere here. Alright guys, well, I guess we're going to end the video right here. I thought that we could explore a lot more out here, but um, apparently not. So, anyways guys, as always, my name is Nathan. I'll catch you on the next video. Take care.